Welcome to the Biotech Whisperer channel. Our topic today is on insect biotechnology and its impacts. Insect biotechnology is color-coded as yellow biotechnology. If you are new here, we are a group of retired professors sharing our knowledge in bite-sized videos. Do subscribe and follow our channel for more updates. Let's dive into the topic for today. Insects are the most diverse of all groups of organisms, with more species than any other. The number of extant species is estimated at about 2 million and counting and potentially represents over 90% of the various animal life forms on Earth. These beautiful insects have been adapted into insect biotechnological uses where the insects, or their cells, to develop products or services. These new substances have applications in medicine, the sustainable protection of plants, and industrial biotechnology. Biotechnology has also along with the other core sciences and engineering advances, making a significant contribution in enabling the development of revolutionary techniques for the betterment of mankind. Areas where biotechnology has made a direct and ongoing impact includes better health care, enhanced food security through sustainable agricultural practices. Yellow or insect biotechnology revolves around the application of biotechnological techniques on insects or their cells to develop products or services for human use. Insect cells for instance the Lepidopteran cells, constitute a competitive strategy to mammalian cells for the manufacturing of biotechnology products. This is especially ideal for the production of complex proteins requiring extensive post-translational modification. These insect biotechnological products have applications in agriculture, medicine, and industrial biotechnology. As a basic research tool, the strategies of insect biotechnology include the sequencing and annotation of insect genomes as well as analyses using comparative genomics. Insect biotechnology is driven by scientific breakthroughs in molecular biology, particularly by the development of tools and techniques that allow genetic characterization and engineering of organisms and cells as with recombinant DNA technology and plant protoplast fusion. Moreover, the medical potential of insects is illustrated in molecular farming where useful compounds, such as antimicrobial peptides are extracted from insects for medicinal use. Insect biotechnological applications is wide, and the main focus is around pest management strategies. For instance, crops can be developed to express insect-specific proteins to confer resistant crops. Moreover, Microbial agents with enhanced insecticidal potency can be designed and engineering of insects to harbor lethal genes that can be conceived to enable transferring of lethal genes to natural populations. With increasing crop yield as the focus, the strategy of insect biotechnology is first geared towards the development of pest management capabilities. One of the more prominent examples is the embedding of Bt, which is the delta endotoxin of Bacillus thuringiensis bacterium into plants. This Bt is non-toxic to humans including surrounding non-target fauna. Its easy application has made possible Bt cotton as well as other commercial and food crops. The Bt when expressed within genetically modified crops generates crystal proteins during sporulation which kills invading insects without the need for polluting commercial fertilizers. Herein, we have a screen grab from Google Images showing Bt cotton, an important cash crop that has been genetically modified. Herein is a screen grab from the Nature Biotechnology website that highlights metabolic engineering industry expanding its products to pest control with biotech insect repellent that is safe for consumers. Outbreaks such as the Escherichia coli 0104H4 in Germany in the year 2011 as well as periodical reports within the media suggest that it is important to focus biotechnological applications from insects to help prevent new emerging bacterial strains and purported resistance. In fact, antibiotic resistance is not a new issue but one that has been ongoing for some time. The urgent need for new antimicrobial drugs from insects which have been shown to produce an array of antimicrobial metabolites can be optimized as templates for further drug development. 
giving mankind additional hope for resolving life-threatening diseases. The baculovirus expression vector system is used to produce recombinant proteins. This is very useful in regards to virology studies and biotechnology applications and can be scaled up for industrial scale production of recombinant proteins. Thousands of recombinant proteins have been produced in baculovirus infected insect cells since the conception of the baculovirus expression vector system. Let's review other insect applications. Insect farming is a novel and alternative strategy for the production of protein-rich food for animals and humans. We have separately a video about black soldier fly, Hermatia elucens, seen as promising source for sustainable production of proteins, lipids and bioactive substances like antimicrobial peptides. Insects have acquired the ability to use almost any organic substrate as a food source, and the black soldier fly can help remove food waste as part of sustainable waste cleanup efforts. There are also ongoing studies on fatty acid metabolism-related enzymes involved in the biosynthesis of fatty acid-derived pheromones which represents an environmentally friendly and economic alternative to the chemical synthesis of pheromones currently deployed in pest management strategies. The greatest advances in insect biotechnology were driven by the developments in modern molecular biology, particularly by the development of techniques, which allowed one to fully sequence the genomes of numerous insect species. In the course of their evolution, insects have developed a huge arsenal of active compounds, which they use to defend themselves against enemies and diseases or to explore novel food sources. The main task of insect biotechnology is to make these natural substances available to mankind. Insect biotechnology, therefore, has considerable economic potential and is a key factor for the propagation of biodiversity for the bioeconomy. Insects are finally rich in proteins and are food sources and play roles in sustainable circular bioecosystems. Bye for now and see you in our next video. I would thank you for helping to share your love for this science channel by clicking the like button and subscribe for future updates.